Sam James from Rich Turn Music and what we have here is a presentation series PS14 CE. Uh, this is the absolute top end of the uh, main production guitars from Taylor. Um, they've really thrown everything at this. Uh, it's got some great detail on it and um, I'm just going to take you through a few of the features uh, so you can hopefully see what you'd be getting for your money if you decided to go for one of these. We're going to start with the back because that really is uh, I think it's nicer than the front. It's uh, a lot of these guitars. Sometimes they should be they should be sat the, the other way around on the wall uh, because th the beauty of the wood really is gorgeous. Now this is Cocobolo on this guitar or Cocobola, depending on how you want to pronounce it. Um, each one's individual, so every single bit of wood, as I'm sure you're aware, is, is different, and they only select the finest pieces of wood uh, for these guitars. So um, Taylor really do go to town on choosing the nicest bits and they save all the nicest bits for these guitars. So this particular one here, as you can see, it's got lovely, lovely book matching on it, matched down the middle, and you've got these lovely appointments and swirls in there. The hues in the wood are fantastic as well. So you goes from really light browns through to darks, really, really dark tones on there, it's lovely. And it's followed through to the sides, all the way around beautiful wood on this guitar and Coco Bell is a wonderful tone wood it, it sounds fabulous and it complements this instrument really really well um, you've got a lovely Sitka spruce top on there very even in tone very light in color very desirable uh, and nice and um, the appointments uh, the abalone green heart abalone inlay all the way around the back here and it follows all the way around the sides on both sides here and then on the top all the way around the top, it's a little bit wider on the top, um, it just, just balances it out nicely. And then you've got the Greenheart Abalone um, rosette there, and the sound held is bound. So inside all these presentation series, um, you find there's no, there's no edges, there's no wood finishes, it's all bound in there, so it really is detailed, really, really lovely. Now the inlay on this is called a Nouveau inlay, and that's the one they're using for this series this year. And uh, it's got, uh, on the tailpiece, um, you can see the appointments there, and then it follows up through the neck. Some people think these guitars are a little bit ostentatious. I have to say, I think it, it really is a lovely guitar, and for this kind of money, you know, the effort and the detail that goes into this really is worth it. Um, when you get up close to it, you can see the fit and finish is absolutely fantastic. Um, it, it's done so well. There's a bit of a common misconception that Taylor guitars um, are, are in some way made on machines, or the, there's, there's machines involved, and there certainly are some machines involved but if you've ever had the opportunity to go or seen online any of the factory tours or, or even go to the factory you would see that these are all done by hand um, people are actually putting in these inlays and everything about this guitar is hand and eye finished they really are detailed and they're absolutely beautiful and the consistency is is just stunning really how they manage to get these guitars um, so good every time is is, is, is incredible um, it, it's beautiful moving up to the top the uh, inlays all the way around the neck green heart abalone and if we flip over to the back on here you'll see that we've got um, a gloss back strap now this is cocobolo as well on the back gloss back strap and um, it comes down to the scarf joint, so it follows the scarf joint around like that, and then you've got the satin neck. So it's got a lovely feel to the neck, it's not sticky, it feels really smooth, feels really nice, but then you're into the gloss of the body. So it, it complements it quite well, and it's that's a hard thing to do, to get that, that um, difference on there. And again, it just adds something special to the guitar. All the presentation series come with Goto 510 machine heads on them. Um, these are probably about the best machine heads you can buy, uh, made in Japan. Now these ones are made specifically for Taylor guitars. So although you can get machine heads that look very similar, these ones are specifically to fit on the Taylor guitar. So um, it's pretty hard to upgrade them afterwards. So again, it's something that you only really see on the, the, the top end instruments. So this is the 1-4 series or the Grand Auditorium. Now the Grand Auditorium, is the pretty much at, at this time, time of shooting this video, pretty much the most popular shape uh, in the UK. Um, it sits in the range um, just just up 
from the smallest guitar. So you've got the Grand Custom, and then you go into the Grand Auditorium. Now, um, because the purfling on these guitars is relatively thin, you do get a very large resonant area on, on the guitar here. So the balance of the instrument is really, really nice, as they are with all tailors. Um, but this uh, th this is the signature size, if you like, for uh, for Taylor guitars, and this is the one that they see as being like their standard kind of their standard focus size. Um, it does sound really really nice, and the balance is there. You've got the warm low end, you've got the high end. You can finger pick it, you can strum it. It covers a lot of bases. Very very nice instrument. Um, there's one other thing to mention on this guitar. Um, if you if you have a little look. You might be able to see on the video there. There's a chamfer on the edge. Now that's got a Laskin armrest, and um, they put these on the presentation series. It's a very expensive feature to have done on any guitar, and um, th the main aim of that, apart from making the guitar look really cool, making it look a little bit different, is that the edge doesn't dig into your arm. So when you've actually got it and you're playing it like that, you can rest on there. It's really comfy to play, really nice. And again, it just adds a little something to the guitar, makes it a little bit more special. So there you have it. That's the um, Taylor uh, presentation series PS14CE. And if you would like to know any more details or any more uh, information about this guitar or any guitars, you're very welcome to phone us or email us, or you can uh, come to our store and try them. Um, so there you have it. Mm -hmm.